Target and I am literally going crazy. So much good stuff in here and I don't need any of this stuff but I had to pick up some stocking stuffers for mom and dad and my traditional popcorn gift for my co-workers. Let's see what else I can find that I don't need. literally just walked in my house I am literally taking off my shoes right now I am going to give you guys a I guess a mini haul from my little Target trip I picked up a bunch of stuff well actually I didn't really get all of the stuff I wanted to get um, it seems like people hit Target early this year and today is um, where's my phone Today's the 10th, so there's like 15 days left until Christmas. And I went to Target because I wanted to get like some stocking stuffers. They always have kind of, you know, cute, little bit bougie <laughs> at Target stocking stuffers. I went to Target and I went over to the pajama section and I saw a couple of pajamas that I really you know we're like oh these are cute the ones i really wanted they didn't have in my size but when i saw the sale sign that said they were originally twenty dollars they were ten dollars y'all i was like i gotta have these so i picked up this first set and it is like um it's gilligan and o'malley or o'malley not sure how to pronounce that sorry if i butchered that but they're thermal pajamas which are so cute and so these are gray and white i got them in a double xl because i don't know if they run small or large or what but i mean it's really stretchy so i feel like i'll be okay i mean they're pajamas i want to be comfortable so that's what they look like top long sleeves and bottoms and then i picked up this other checkered pair as well and it's kind of like a play on flannel i guess it isn't red and black like a traditional flannel but it is like red and blue and yeah so i got these in a double xl as well and it's by the same company and yeah a top and a bottom ten dollars for these $10 for these, so $20 for two sets of thermal pajamas, which, you know, in the past, I think thermals have just become really popular again, because in the last couple of years, it's been so hard for me to find them, especially in like a plus size. So I got those two sets for moi. Um, moving on for my parents because they are spoiled um, I always do like a stocking for them and it's not necessarily a stocking per se I think maybe one year I did stockings actual stockings but sometimes I do bags sometimes I do an object filled with things this year I am going to be doing this super cute box I love the packaging at Target like you can find some really classy looking boxes and some really cute wrapping paper you know I don't really like the whole ho 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 Merry Christmas stuff it's not really my thing but I thought this box was really cute my mom will get a kick out of it my dad he don't care he just want the, the goodies inside so I got them um, these boxes so I got two of these and it just has this little tag on it and the tag says, um, do not open until December 25th. No peeking. They won't have a chance to peek anyway because this will be at my house and they'll just be here when they come over. So it just has this little belt detail, which is actually kind of like a little felt. And then it has the buckle. And then you open it up and it's just like an empty box inside. So 
yep i got two of these because if you don't get them the same thing they will fuss like little kids so this box is from the wonder shop at target gift box and let's see if it has a name in case you're trying to find it online no it doesn't have a name um and I don't know what all these numbers mean, but the box was $5. So I spent $10 on these boxes because I had one for her and one for him. And I'm gonna actually open up the second box because there's something inside of it. Um, and no, I did not steal these. I did pay for them, but I got them um, these candy canes um, and they're from that company. What's the name of that company? It's a really popular company that makes candy canes. Um, God, is it Harrods or something? Or am I thinking about shopping? Maybe it's Harold's or something. I don't know. I can't remember what the name of it is. Hammond! That's what it is. Yeah, I was thinking about shopping, huh? So, Hammond'sCandies.com. But I usually find these big candy canes at one of the most peculiar places to find them. Kinko's. There's a Kinko's not too far from where I live. And I would go over there and they have little gift items and stuff that I think you know I like to pick things up from all over the place <laughs> and put it together and so I usually find these there what's the the big thing about these are they break so easily so I didn't really have a lot of choices for flavors in Target because most of them were broken but this is the rainbow blast and when I was younger my mom is totally into holidays she put up the Christmas tree and we would put real candy canes on there I'm not sure if people still do that um as you can see my tree is pretty minimalistic stick um but <laughs> i love to give them these so they like them so i got two of these one for mom one for dad um honestly i was kind of disappointed in the like things the items that they had it's just seemed like i said everybody came really early and picked over the stuff so um i got this these are cute um so I always include like some candy usually I put just a bunch of snacks and then a couple of little you know chotskis or whatever in their boxes or bags or stockings um, so I got this this is um, a 10 I really like this It's really cute and it has Snickers inside mini Snickers and so this will be for dad and then mom likes M&Ms so I got her um, this little tin and it has M&Ms in it and the tins are just really nice like really cute really kind of posh i guess it'll look really nice inside so i got these for them okay i know i know i love them my parents i love them so the next thing i got oh my god i saw this and i was like these are so cute you i know my mom is gonna get a kick out of this she is just like she's the cutest so i found these cans of instant snow this is gonna be so cute so i got a can for mom i got a can for dad he probably won't even look at his. Um, me and mom will probably play with these after dinner um, on Christmas. So yeah, totally love these. Such a cute item to add to the stocking. And the next thing I got were these. And honestly, mom does not like... Um, my mother is not into Ferrero Rocher. My dad is. So he's probably going to eat hers. And she probably just won't even care. Because she doesn't care... Um, for them that much anyway so i found these forever rocher stars oh my god they are so pretty and when i'm looking for stocking stuffers i'm looking for things that are high quality i'm looking at the packaging of items because i want everything to look really cute um in the bag i want it to look luxurious i want it to look posh um glamorous so i'm always looking for those aspects of items that i'm going to include in side of my goodie bags so these are the things that will be in my stockings let's see i don't think i got is there anything else for them um oh no i didn't get anything else no i got myself some snacks i'll show y'all my snacks in a second but um so i, I also went ahead and picked up one other item like i said they just really didn't have a lot of good stuff so i'll probably come back and show you guys what i end up putting in their stocking um all together there's some local businesses that i want to support so there's a couple i actually need to text um my popcorn connect that naughty but nice popcorn um and check the description box for a link to them um 
I'm going to contact them to get some popcorn and there's a new cute little chocolate shop that opened up in town and if I can get to it um, I'm going to go in there and pick up some um, chocolate rosemary candy bars oh my god they're so good whole nother story let me get back on test but um my co-workers at work so uh our department has expanded <laughs> so uh, i had to i decided to go ahead and pick up what i usually do usually it's just two guys and in the past i've just been getting them popcorn from target um these large popcorns uh and they come in different flavors and so this is a cute quick cheap uh, fix and not I mean it's cheap it's affordable let me not say cheap this is a cute quick affordable fix um, for a Christmas gift I think these are like about five dollars I think um, a container is pretty big they're guys they don't care um, I do have one female co-worker um, now and so I did pick up these and I just picked up different flavors because they all have kind of different taste buds so I got the chunky chunky I got the chunky chocolate um popcorn it's indulgent snack mix chunky chocolate made with real butter with popcorn pretzels and potato chips and let's see i also got the um i have one of my co-workers i don't know if she's gonna be into this or not but i got her the butter toffee because i was like let me just get something i don't think she's gonna be about all those flavors and stuff so she doesn't really eat a lot of sweets but this kind of reminds me of the original like crunch and munch type of popcorn so i got her this one and then i got i've got three male staff members so i got the cinnamon pecan for one of my co-workers i feel like he'll like this one and then the only other one I got okay i have one of my co-workers that i know is really into like nuts and stuff and so i got this macadamia nut one because i feel like he will enjoy this i actually think i got him this one last year um so we'll see and then i got one more of that same one i showed you guys earlier the chocolate cho chunky chocolate excuse me the chunky chocolate one i got another one of these uh for one of my other co-workers because i don't he's just like easy to please so actually for my boss and I need something to put them in so I found these cute wine bags that say Merry Christmas um like I said the popcorns were like five dollars these bags are like a dollar fifty a piece and while they are meant for wine they're gonna be meant for popcorn from the Queen so the popcorn fits in here perfectly we lay it back so you can see and then there's just a tub of popcorn in there and then i'll top off my gift with like a gift card uh, for each one of them i'll um figure out like starbucks and their favorite tool shops and stuff like that so i'll attach a little gift card to each one of those and that will be my gift from them to me easy quick cute um and enjoyable i love to give people things that they're actually gonna want and use i hate getting like random stuff that i can't use but i'm always grateful for whatever gifts people give me i have rambled on long enough i hope you guys enjoyed this a mini vlog slash haul from target uh, for my faux vlogmas will there be another vlog Will there not be? I don't know. Subscribe and stay tuned. Bye! <laughs> Thanks for watching!